Hi, in this video I'm going to give an overview of a great new feature we have uh, deployed across a range of boxes including the Optimus here which is the automatic uh, channel updating and how this works is what we've done is we've embedded a HTTP link into the firmware we've put on the boxes uh, so as long as you're buying a pre-programmed box it will be applicable to your box and how this works is um, if at some stage a new channel becomes available there's a new firmware that's available that you'd like to go and get instead of having to download it put it on a usb stick and upload it onto the box what you can do is you can actually follow the steps i'm going to um, outline here which is use the wi-fi connection uh, or a, a lan connection to be able to connect the box onto a network link back to our for our, our um, server and just pull down the latest channel list and the latest firmware in a very quick and painless process. So I'm going to give an overview of how that works now. So we have the box set up, satellite um, connection on it currently, and we have a LAN cable going directly into it. We could be doing it from a dongle either though. So what we'll do here is I'm just going to hit the menu button on the remote. I'm going to arrow over as far as system and I'll go to the software upgrade, which is what we want to do. And I want to upgrade uh, HTTP okay so we could go at uh, different ways of upgrading here but the HTTP option is where we want to go and we can see a file here update.abs now it's important to note that this file is not on the box it's actually on our server so it's seen the link there to it and I just hit the red button here and it's saying what we want to do so there's different options here channel list um, software with no channel list so this is all embedded in a single file and you can just extract the part that you need. But the safest option here is to go to all software plus boot bootloader. And I'll just come along and I'll select OK. So this next part of the process is going to take uh, about a minute, minute and a half. So what's happening here is we're pulling the latest version off of our server and back. So if we ever come along, um, the key point here is that the old version of the firmware here is M36.12.104 and the new version is um, M36.12.104 so they're actually the same ones here so this is a demonstration obviously but um, uh, if as long as what's on the server is a newer version than what's on your box it'll be able to take it down and download it uh, and that's why we're constantly would say every time we're changing channel list we're making sure to put it onto the latest firmware put it onto the server and have it available there so all you have to do here is just sit back and wait so it'll go through the whole process here pull down both the firmware and the, uh, the channel list put it onto the box and what it'll do then is it'll reboot the box and when it comes back up we'll say you'll have all the channels there uh, in terms of the satellites now it's important to note we'll say when we're automating this process we can do it for the satellite because there's a single Astra 2 28.8 degree satellite covering all of Europe for the UK channels or will mainly Ireland the UK parts of Northern Europe um, but in terms of the terrestrial channels it's not possible to put them onto the channel list here and there's one very very specific reason for that is that the terrestrial channels you're picking up on your box will be coming from your local transmitter and in Ireland for instance between transmitters and subtransmitters this is in the region of 40 to 50 transmitters and in the UK there probably would be in the region of about 150 to 200 transmitters to cover the entire country. Um, so what you'll need to do is if you do go down this process you'll just need to tune the Irish channels back in or the terrestrial channels should I say and that is a very straightforward process simply because there's a couple of hundred satellite channels possibly but there's a much more limited number of terrestrial channels the process is much easier and uh, they'll just slot back in quite neatly into the channel list lineup so we're coming towards the, uh, the end of this process here so we'll just wait and see what happens next um, so what we have included in each box now is we're putting in a list of the step-by-step -step guide and uh, on the product page here as well we'll be giving a list of all the steps and how to do it so um, it's something that we put a huge amount of effort here in freetv.ie to do because what we're really trying to do is to replicate um, to a certain extent the freesat plus features or the freesat features which is takes all the hardship of manually tuning um, boxes and uh, adding channels on which can happen over a period of time and it can be critical we'll say if it's a key channel that you look at uh, where the frequency has changed or if it's a reality of a new channel has become available and you want to be able to tune and add that on uh, to the channel uh, lineup so in particular what we think that this is a great feature particularly if somebody is buying a box for somebody else 
uh, who's not very techni technically proficient and you want to leave them with a very, very simple uh, lineup on it. So to our knowledge, we'll say we're the only company in Ireland or the UK offering this across the full range of the boxes we do. And it simply have a software developer who works here on a contract basis uh, doing this, keeping them up to date for us. So I'll just go up here. I'll uh, go up as far as the UK there. And if we just go here, we'll say, we'll just say that we have the full uh, channel things here. And all we can do is their special interest ones and we can just arrow out and I can just go up to the entertainment channels here and you can just see we have the BBCs, the ITBs, etc. So that's exactly where we need to be and I can just exit directly out there. So um, so that's it anyway, an overview of uh, how to use the automatic channel updating feature on the Optimus uh, setup box.